Welcome to Module 5, Lesson 3. Today we will be learning how to partition a whole into equal parts by drawing pictorial area models. We are learning this so that we can understand fractions as equal parts of a whole. And we'll know that we're successful today when we can use a model to show equal parts. Is the rectangle partitioned into four equal parts? No, it is not. As you can see, this part does not equal this part. Now is the rectangle partitioned into four equal parts? Yes it is. All of the parts are the same size. There are four equal parts. The fractional unit for each part is fourths. One fourth. Each part is called one-fourth or one-quarter. There are four-fourths in the whole figure. Three copies of one-fourth are shaded. What fraction is shaded? three-fourths. There are one-fourth, two-fourths, three-fourths. The circle is split into two equal parts. What is the fractional unit for each part? The fractional unit is halves. Each part is a half. And there are two halves. What fraction of the circle is shaded? One half of the circle is shaded. How many equal parts are here? Three. There are three equal parts. What is the fractional unit? The fractional unit is thirds. What is each part called? Each part is called one third. What fraction is shaded? Two-thirds are shaded. How many equal parts are there?
there are eight equal parts. What is the fractional unit? The fractional unit is eighths. What is each part called? Each part is called one eighth. What fraction is shaded? Five eighths are shaded. Now it's time for our read, draw, write question. We're going to read the question together and pick out the most important information. We'll draw a picture to help solve the problem. And then we'll always answer this question as a sentence using information from the question. It says partition a rectangle into six equal parts. Then shade one part. And the question we want to answer is what fraction is shaded? So first we're going to partition into six equal parts and then we'll shade one part and then we'll answer the question what fraction is shaded. So I'm going to go over to my Google Jamboard And I'm going to draw a tape diagram because it says a rectangle. And I'm going to partition into six equal parts. So I know this is one whole, the whole thing and six equal parts, so this would be one sixth. Okay, going back to my question, it says shade one part. Okay, so I've shaded one part, and now I need to answer my question, and going back to the question, it says, what fraction is shaded? So one part is one-sixth, so one-sixth is shaded. The fraction... that is shaded is one sixth. Okay, I've completed. I'm happy with my answer, so I'm gonna go back to the presentation and look at the answer. Answer, one sixth is shaded, so we were correct. Okay, now it's your turn to do a read, draw, write question. You're going to read, we'll read the question together, and then you'll draw on your own and answer the question in complete sentences. And when you're done, you can look in the description box below and check your answer against the correct answer. It says, partition a rectangle into four equal parts, then shade one part. What fraction is shaded? Okay, pause the video here, do your very best work, and I'll see you in the next lesson.